Hello everyone, how are you? Um, as you know, I'm Yasser and um, I'm very much uh, creating this video to share and explain what is going on with me, what is happening and things like that. Um, what happened is that um, when I start travel, uh, <laughs> September 2nd to South America, um, I did have, I do have uh, e-commerce stores and businesses online so it can create me a good passive income. But what, um, when, I, when I arrived to South America, uh, the traffic took uh, downturn and uh, there was a huge uh, decrease in, uh, in um, traffic. Um, and then um, I had to travel from Colombia to Ecuador. I did do some volunteering here. But the thing is that um, after October 7, as if you if you knew about me before that, I was um, reporting uh, some suspicious activity of why of my of like how did I become Canadian citizen? My parents were completely. Uh, um, falsely claiming they are in Canada and that never and the um, they didn't have um, any legal rights uh, to be Canadian so what happened is that they, I was nine years old about about that age uh, uh, during the immigration and Canadian citizen I was like close to 13 years old and I wasn't aware of what happening I was in medical conditions I had um, some teeth um, I was I went through accident and I was um, you know recovering from this accident and I did not I did not know anything about the immigration or capability of my parents so when I did when I did uh, grow a little bit older uh, sadly the 9-11 happened and suddenly my parents were very suspicious include my uncles they were like very scared and concerning about what happened so in that time i wasn't mature enough to understand what what happened but sadly i found out that um, my parents my uncles and united states they worked together to mislead the the investigation happened in new brunswick uh, uh, by cia 9 11 causes and i found out that they were actually misleading and lying again to the CIA investigation of 9-11. Uh, sadly, what happened is that uh, early transformations uh, of Iraq, uh, my parents um, uh, were very much secretive. My uncles, Khaled Mahmoud, was, uh, he, 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 he used to live in uh, New Brunswick. And he was very involved with the uh, uh, with the illegal immigration happened in Kuwait uh, by Canadian embassy in Saudi Arabia and London, Ontario. So, sadly, like I found out that uh, they were uh, completely misleading the, the U.S. intelligence about the, uh, the causes of 9/11. And then, um, what happened after that is that they had to keep lying. So, uh, there is they helped organization intelligence from Middle East to use the illegal immigration workability that caused horrible events to help bad people such as Iranian militia, Hamas, and all those terrorist organizations to keep the system working. They, they, they wanted just, they, don't, they, didn't, they did not want to get caught by, um, by their illegal immigration workability that happened before and caused a lot of terrorism. And sadly, I know that the, the youngest brother of my mother bad DNA <laughs> so I want to make sure they are bad DNA to me of course so they are bad DNA they were very involved with Hamas terrorist organization establishment and um, I was completely shocked by Canadian government involvement uh, with the with the establishment of these terrorist organizations early, early, early 2000s uh, I do have a lot of evidence to support uh, my claim. I do have uh, evidence to to send it to the FBI. But the thing is that Canadian, um, there is involvement from former government of Canada with this establishment. 
that make it hard for me as a person to 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 connect or to contact from Canadian soil with the, with the with the with the FBI or with the, with the U.S. intelligence. And after October seventh, uh, this evidence, the damaging evidence, became a lot more damaging to the former government of Canada, uh, which uh, which made it like very. Uh, challenge like I'm really uh, like tomorrow I will I will be ending up in, in the airport coming so probably within a few days I will be like claiming asylum seeking so I will be like uh, going through a lot of changing but I really want to make it right I do not want it, this kind of things to continue anymore so I want to make sure that with your support I can contact the FBI the FBI can be able to investigate the evidence and connect correctly with what happened. So to make sure that those organizations existed in the Middle East, uh, targeted USA or NATO or its allies to be completely destroyed. Uh, um, actually, I don't know what to say. <laughs> it is my, uh, my urgent. So today is my last day in the hostel, last night in the hostel. Tomorrow I will be like going to the airport. Like I don't know what it. Will, I will be awkward a little bit, but that's what will happen. I hope like this video will be connected with the, with some media. I know like news media. They think it is like I don't know what they think, but I'm telling you that it is, it is, it is supported with fact, and uh, it should be taken seriously. Um, I hope I hear back from you um, about that. As I said, um, I have a very low fund at this point, so I kind of like I will be going through a very hard time. So it's, uh, you can uh, keep up uh, following my uh, by 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 adding my add me as a friend or um, by following me on social media. Uh, I do I do go through I go I do go by. Uh, Yes, adventures as well. So that also me. I supposed to have adventures right now, but sadly after October seven, my heart got very broken by innocent uh, people uh, from Israel. Uh, they had nothing to do with this. They were innocent, uh, beautiful souls, uh, good human beings. Uh, they just um, they just happened to be around the evils like. That what happened. They, be, they were around the evil organization and regimes, and sadly, they uh, they experienced a very sad ending. So I I really want to be sending uh, my um, my full support to Seth Israel. Uh, you are amazing. You are strong. I know you will be standing from your falls uh, stronger than before. Just. Um, Let's work together and destroy terrorist organization together. <laughs> thank you for thank you everyone for your support and listening. Take care.